All right, cry. This is my very stupid personal tutorial to teach you how to do keyframes. I am actually watching you stream at this moment, cry, while making this video for you. Hopefully, it goes all right. All right, so we're selecting a portion of our clip. It's a little bit louder than I want it to be. All right, so first, you hit V to make that blue line appear. Double click on the line to create a keyframe. Simple as that. Obviously you need two keyframes to make the support and then you use one to pull it down. Simple shit. I know you got this cry. Instead of, you know, keyframing a dip, if something is just peaking too loud, or if you wanted to boost something up, you could go the other way. Now, I'm just going to show you fading out. The main point of this is to show you that you can also add different types of fade-ins and out, just like you have when you're doing your crossfades. There you go, so you see we got our sharp hold. You get the idea. Hopefully, this has been relatively educational, and you will now be able to do keyframes in your audio so you don't have to do split clips just to make sure the audio flows properly, if that makes sense. Hopefully you watched this and learned something, or maybe you never even saw this thing, but who cares? It's 5.25 in the morning for me, 8.25 in the morning for you. Fuck it. Good night, good morning. See you later, cry.